I'm Altavis Mornings. Let's take a look at what's making business news today. Financial Services Minister Ryan Pinder told delegates at the Bahamas Financial Services Board's Bahamas Landfall in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil this week that these are exciting times in the international financial services and business marketplace and the Bahamas could not be more excited not only about its future but the future working with the people and businesses of Brazil. Pointing out that Brazil is the only Latin American country that has a resident embassy here in the Bahamas, Minister Pinder said the government anticipates further developing their business partnership with Brazil to promote natural synergies and develop more international business. Well, if you haven't done so, there is still time for Bahamas Financial Services Board members to submit nominations for the 2012 Financial Services Industry Excellence Awards. For the 12th straight year, the BFSB is partnering with professional industry associations to recognize individuals and companies that made significant contributions to the development over the sector. In international business, Japan Airlines took another step toward redemption Wednesday as it was relisted on the Tokyo Stock Exchange almost three years after a blockbuster bankruptcy. The initial public offering was expected to raise $8.5 million, over 3,790 yen a share. The IPO was the second largest of the year, trailing only Facebook. Remember, you can send us an email or join us on www.znsbahamas.com or become our friend on ZNS's official Facebook page. And that will end tonight's edition of the Business Beat, sponsored by Royal Fidelity. I'm Alta Viz Mannings. Thanks so much for watching.